Hey, what's going on guys? It's No Shoes and we're back with another K Reno Tuesday and today we're going to be reacting to Digital Hypnosis. This was suggested by Vel, so thank you Vel for the suggestion. Keep coming in the comments down below. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe, especially if you want to see more K every single Tuesday. Also, I heard about a minute maybe a minute 30 of this track before I realized my mic was not actually working. So, I've heard a little bit of this so far, but just barely. Without any further ado, let's get right into this. Let's see what Digital Hypnosis is all about. Let's see what K Reno got to say. Let's see what Tragic got on the beat. Let's get it. At my command, you will focus on me and only me. You will respond to my call no matter where you are on the planet. Every aspect of your life will be conducted through my channels. Information, entertainment, love, food, all of your necessities will go through me. We are now one. Every invention has an intention, some for paths of ascension. Yeah. Great start to the track. Love the feel of like, you know, close your eyes and listen to that intro and imagine, you know, Kay sitting in front of you with the, uh, the stopwatch swinging back and forth. That kind of, not really calming, but almost like a trance like command like he's guiding you through that trance feels great that layering that comes in on the last bar of it really adds a lot of depth to it and then that drop into the verse it felt funny to me the first time i heard it it still feels a little funny but i think it's just because there's no like clear line of demarcation from where the intro turns into the verse so the verse just kind of like Boom, it's there right after that trance. And it's a little bit jarring, but not necessarily in a bad way. All of your necessities will go through me. We are now one. Every invention has an intention. Some for paths of ascension. Others' purposes to savage dimension. The misuse of technology worsens. World's curses emerging, causing a massive surge in its perversion. Mind control motors started the issue. Purposely plotted against you. Because true intelligence is not artificial. Features of devices expand. They purposely plan to make us feel as if we have a universe in our hands. If you stare in the portal, more distractions. And what I realized when we got to the hook the first time around, and y'all hear it in a second here, is that this is about being trapped in your phone, stuck in the loop. Maybe not even your phone, the TV, Xbox, you name it. And um, talking about these devices, their features expand, make you feel like you got the power of the universe in your hand, and you just get drawn in and sucked into that. And honestly, that's something I've been trying to get rid of lately because I hate being stuck in my phone, but it's just so much stuff in it. Some devices expand, they purposely plan to make us feel as if we have a universe in our hands. If you stare in the portal, more distractions grab you and hold you. You scroll through with the focus view, now it controls you. Overloaded by all of the open roads that it shows you. The whole scope of this roguish world is at your disposal. Your mind is the target of forces designed. Yeah. And I think that's something, the whole scope of this something world is at your disposal. I feel like that's one of the biggest issues, man. Like, we are way too connected to the news, to just the internet, to events all around the world that have zero effect on our day-to-day -day lives. It's just everything is right there at your fingertips. And honestly, I think it's too much for most people, if not all of us. Shows you the whole scope of this roguish world is at your disposal. Your mind is the target of forces designed to dissolve it. More time in the darkness makes the laws blind and lethargic. Profusely distracted, your actions reducing the fragments. The computer's a magnet that has you useless and stagnant under digital hypnosis. You drift slowly down the well as your consciousness fails under the spell and critical psychosis. Your attention span is held in a cell. Just like someone in jail under digital hypnosis. Yeah. And then I love the wordplay of stuck in a cell like you're in jail, but also stuck in the cell of your cell phone. It's beautiful, man. Great wordplay here. If a really fun way to make like a super vivid track with a lot of great imagery about just being on your phone. It's it works so well. 
the digital hypnosis You drift slowly down the well As your consciousness fails under the spell And critical psychosis Your attention span is held in a cell Just like someone in jail You gaze at it attentively enslaved And defenseless, organic forms of mental Stimulation fade from your interest The template you introduce it to your infants At an early age, so by digital Means little boys and girls are raised Glued to superficial visuals Too, it imprisons you, then inhibits yeah, it feels like a little bit slower, a little bit more chilled out than the uh, than the typical K we've been listening to lately. There's a little bit of less of that bite in his voice, which makes sense because this song feels more aimed at benefiting people rather than like some of the tracks where he just like talks his trash, talks his shit, has his fun. <clears throat> and then the instrumental is gorgeous. So many different textures going on in there. We got that high like vocal sample coming in as an instrument every so often. Then you have this bass line that's just muddy and watery and gurgly down in the bottom of the track. We got these great synth leads coming in during the hook. There's like some very subtle like plucked strings. Just beautiful. Official visuals too. It imprisons you, then inhibits your peripheral view. Then you travel slow into the rabbit hole. Different categories, data load from the average shows to pornographic mode. The social network Ooh. inertia grows. I want to hear that rhyme to pornographic mode. Hold up. Peripheral view. Then you travel slow into the rabbit hole. Different categories, data load from the average shows to pornographic mode. The social network inertia grows. The content disturbs your soul. But even so, you can't control the urge to scroll. Your motivational circuits blow. And work is no longer an urgent goal. As divergence seem irreversible. You assume the fate of subhuman state. Days on the calendar. Love the rhymes. Great delivery. Super clean. Bring this back just a little bit. I'm intrigued by this line he just had about work. And it seems like how work relate is fits in relation to this digital trance. Even so, you can't control the urge to scroll. Your motivational circuits blow. That is fact. Control the urge to scroll. And that's the second time he's mentioned scroll throughout this track as well. Which, I mean, of course. Because, you know, you just keep scrolling. Just keep flicking up. The content disturbs your soul, but even so, you can't control the urge to scroll. Your motivational circuits blow, and work is no longer an urgent goal as divergence seem irreversible. You assume the fate of subhuman state. Days on the calendar enumerate as the wasted hours accumulate undeniably. So the second you step away from it entirely, you mire in separation anxiety. Digital hypnosis. You Damn, even saying got separation anxiety from the phone. That's facts for some people, man. Honestly, you know, sometimes you like in the house and you're like, ah, I should take my room to the kitchen or I should take my phone to the kitchen with me from my room, not take my room to the kitchen. Let's just take Bikini Bottom and move it somewhere else. But, um, but absolutely. So that way you can have it right next to you instead of just like coming back to it in 10 minutes. What, what's the worst thing that's going to happen? You know, but we all do it. I, I'm guilty. That's for certain. Drift slowly down the well as your consciousness fails under the spell and critical psychosis. Your attention span is held in a cell just like someone in jail under digital hypnosis. You drift slowly down the well as your consciousness fails under the spell and critical psychosis. Your attention span is held in a cell just like someone in jail. Weeks, months of overconsumption. Wow. The layering on this. The more and more we get into this track. The more little pieces of this instrumental I'm hearing, sounds like during the hook and maybe even during the verse as well, we'll see there's like this beautiful horn type of instrument coming in in the back. It's barely there. It's almost atmospheric with how well it blends into everything else. But so many little flavors, so many different textures all combine. They're coming in and out. You know, there's no like even loop necessarily aside from the drum kit we're getting a lot of change with these instruments where they come in and where they drop out at beautiful really great mix on this honestly i think tragic and k reno might be like the the goaded combo of producer and rapper as far as k reno's projects go
Span is held in a cell just like someone in jail. Weeks, months of overconsumption, screen drunk and despondent, becoming one with non nutritive content. Smart cars and phones direct you, smart televisions connect to the game and systems built to possess you. Disconnected our best self. Beautiful. Love that idea. Drop the drums out, drop pretty much everything out besides like that kind of like ambient, real wide reverb layer of. It feels like piano or something, but I don't think that's exactly what it is. Let Kay's voice shine over it. And then that bar with non-nutritive content hits so hard, man, because so much of this content out here is just brainless. And if you think mine is, let me know in the comments. <laughs> At least I try to give y'all something. Your attention span is held in a cell Just like someone in jail Weeks, months of overconsumption Screen drunk and despondent Becoming one with non-nutritive content Smart cars and phones direct you Smart televisions connect to the game And systems built to possess you Disconnected our best self and rebuilt us No real pictures to women addicted to filters Through endless corridors you slide through Your mind remotely abides to every direction that it guides you Inside these applications you find and then, ooh, looks like we're getting another change, another drop out of the drums. Really evolving here in what I believe is the third verse at this point. Yeah, three. But um, but K, when he's rapping over the beat, it's easy to lose it in the soup of everything that's happening. But his changes of inflection and like accenting of different words and syllables add so much structure to his flows and it makes it so much more satisfying to listen to because even if he's not like rhyming on every four whatever it might be he's still giving us that punch which you know tells you where to bop your head where to tap your foot where to you know move your arm whatever it is you're doing with it just works so well. Just perfectly timed. Through your mind remotely abides to every direction that it guides you inside these applications you found. There's no sacred ground to lay down. Your child is now in a predator playground. Your feelings are what they've experimented with. AI that can read intimate thoughts in your mind and print the images. Your work ethic is practically absent. Captivated by a platform that'll have you erratic if it collapses. Doing what it commands and makes you fascinated with a breakthrough. Created to ultimately replace you out of a sound. Dang. Beautiful, beautiful. Bring this back a little bit. That's interesting. Talking about if the platform collapse, collapses, it'll have you feeling erratic. Oddly enough, I kind of relish in the idea that at some point we're going to reach this social media saturation. And maybe we're getting there already where there's just too many platforms. TikTok, Twitter, Instagram, uh. You name it. The people used to use Yik Yak. I, I don't even know what people use anymore. At a certain point, we don't need more websites to post pictures on, type out our little comments, and show, show short videos and just all of the nonsense, man. Like, look, as a content creator, maybe it sounds crazy for me to being saying for me to be saying that. I am sick of it. How many platforms do people need to be on to just, to just like do their thing and gain a following? It's it's ridiculous, man. It's crazy. Oh, have you have you started making TikTok videos yet? Oh, are you making LinkedIn posts? Oh, are you putting up twi Instagram shorts like or Instagram reels? It's like nah, bruh. Nah, that's crazy. Captivated by a platform that'll have you erratic if it collapses Doing what it commands and makes you Fascinated with a breakthrough Created to ultimately replace you Out of a sound sleep it wakes you You race and can't wait to get to all of the shady places it takes you Your device is alive, it has eyes and it hears Soon as you mention the product, the advertisement appears You thirst and gamble mm. online nerd Yes sir, as soon as you mention the product, the advertisement appears 
And if you would like to help support me in bringing y'all less ads as time goes on and making y'all a bunch of great content, check out the link tree in the description. It'll bring you straight to my buy me a coffee and a bunch of other places that you can check out the fun stuff I'm doing. At the buy me a coffee, you can get access to the Discord community, a bunch of great people, some extra content. You'll be able to see stuff that I'm working on before it comes out. And I got an EP on the way, and I just finished the last beat tonight so check out the buy me a coffee i'd really appreciate and thank you to everybody who already does but let's keep this rolling here as soon as you mention the product the advertisement appears you thirst and gamble online nervously and hurriedly submerge your financial future in digital currency be one of these dreams with autonomy trusting what the numbers be as we invest in the fast fall and Remodeling you into an inoperative fool while you're watching the TV. Beautiful. The TV is watching you too. Self discipline. Oh, I like that. When you're watching the TV, the TV is watching you too. Kind of like a big brother esque vibe, but then it also reminds me of um, Friedrich Nietzsche had a quote about like if you if you look into the void, the look the void will look back into you, and um, it kind of reminds me of that where like. The way he's describing that technology starts to corrupt you and pull you into its trance. It's you're becoming a part of it as much as it is becoming a part of you. And you carry that around with you. We invest in the fast fall of the economy is remodeling you into an inoperative fool while you're watching the TV. The TV is watching you too. Self discipline overran, so we are not to withstand. Lost in the labyrinth, the website's locked in a trance. You voluntarily that's, give it your life. And that's really the key, isn't it? Is the self discipline of it all. I was actually having a conversation about how to use your phone less and how to use it better, you know, when you inevitably do pull your phone out and use it. And um, the idea we came up with was having intention behind it. Don't just pick it up so you can mess around and do nothing and whatever, whatever. Pick it up when you have a notification and you need to reply to somebody's text or something. Obviously, like he said, the self-discipline. This is all easier said than done. And it's something I'm trying to practice myself. It's honestly crazy that I'm coming back to this suggestion today just by coincidence. The website's locked in a trance. You voluntarily give it your life daily in private. You submit all of your personal information inside it. It's the worldwide web. The lower desire finder with a buzz trapped in it. The spider is this designer. This is digital hypnosis. You drift slowly down the well as your consciousness fails under the spell and critical psychosis. Your attention span is held in a cell just like someone in jail under digital hypnosis. You drift slowly down the well as your consciousness fails under the spell and critical psychosis your attention span is held in a cell just like someone in jail Ooh. the echo and the panning the reverb slow a little rip oh absolutely beautiful man absolutely beautiful i know i was a little confused when we hit that like intro to the first verse transition but once we were in it man that is tight that was digital hypnosis from k reno thank you again to bell for the suggestion keep the comments coming let me know what you guys want to see next time don't forget to hit like hit subscribe and hit that bell if you want to see more videos like this much love to everybody in the no shoes gang and i'll see you all next time